guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Tashawn J. If you're returning, welcome back. Okay, so I know y'all see what's going on. This craziness on my face and this mess on my bed. I am doing a Boria makeup look. Yes, I recreated something like I would like I would wear this on Euphoria. Like if I was on Euphoria, I would be that girl. This is so different, you guys. It's out of this world, different for me. This is a makeup look that's out way out of my comfort zone. And I can't believe I did the jewels right. Like I'm so shocked. But anyway. I hope you guys watch Euphoria. First off, Euphoria is like the most amazing show. I love Euphoria. I love the issues that it tackles. It tackles drug addiction, um, things that, you know, teenagers and even college kids go through um, in today's generation. So if you guys don't know about Euphoria, y'all definitely need to go check it out. And my good girl Zendaya is like one of the main characters and she does an amazing job at that role. But anyway, let me stop chit-chatting. If you guys wanna see more of how I achieved my Euphoria makeup look, then definitely keep on watching. All right, y'all, so let's get into it and prime the face. We're gonna use the Touch and Sew More Problem primer and i'm just gonna put that all throughout my face and just rub 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 that in next i'm just using the nyx eyeshadow base in the color skin tone and i'm just gonna put that all throughout my eyelid Alright, so now I'm using the Morphe palette, that's the 35L palette, and I'm using that light brown shade, and I'm just putting that all throughout the lid just to set the eyeshadow base. Oh, the sense that you can confess, I'm just your ghost if we're not undressed, part of me wish that we never met, but you act like we never got to waste it in the bathroom of your parents' house. Then you kissed me in the backseat of a taxi ride And we said things that were cheesy But we meant them, they were feelings And now you deny it Alright, so I'm putting the Barb color on my eyelid From the Ambreezy Anastasia palette Two eyeshadow guys, that's it Two eyeshadows Like, come on, we gon' we gonna keep it simple We ain't gonna do too much the glam euphoria looks that's coming later that's coming later y'all and i'm just like putting it all throughout the lid but i'm not being messy with it i'm gonna just use a white eyeliner just to brighten up my eyes um the white eyeliner is okay that's actually from Rimmel london but it's it's okay y'all can use a better opaque one um, then I just moved into foundation from Fenty Beauty, um, that's the original foundation in the color 440, and then I just color corrected. I know my foundation looked crazy, but it's gonna work together, like, don't worry about it. <laughs> it's gonna work. Alright, you know the good girl, Tarte Shape Tape Concealer in the color Deep, and I just, you know, put it in the places you conceal. I already know my conceal routine. And I'm just blending it out. Then I just wanted to do a little nose contour. And that's the color Mahogany in LA Pro Girl Concealer. Those concealers are really, really good, you guys, if you're looking for a concealer on a budget. And they just blend seamlessly. Um, I definitely added some Fenty Beauty powder um, under my eyes um, and then I'm just blending out that nose contour. You want to keep it blended so it's not harsh. Mm -hmm. 
And then I'm just, you know, adding the dark color to my cheeks. Um, just the contour. I definitely need a better <laughs> contour stroke game, y'all. And I just was today years old that using a brush to set your concealer is way better to me than a beauty blender. Like, look how flawless my face looks. Like, wow. I'm gonna start using a brush. Like, wow. And then I'm just using the CoverGirl um, bronzer. Um, I don't know if it happens bronzer anymore, guys. But, you know, I'm gonna just use it up because it's been in my collection. So, look how chiseled I'm getting it. I'm getting better, y'all, with my bronzer. But I'm just showing you the two products that I used. And... That is the Maybelline um, powder foundation in the color 440. That's the Fit Me line. I just wanted to set the whole face, make sure everything is flawless and smooth. And to not be powdery, y'all, make sure y'all spraying y'all face. And that's also the Maybelline blush palette. I used both of those two colors. And I definitely wanted to use those two colors to like basically show that my cheeks are flushed. I know it looks like harsh, but you gotta understand, like, this is euphoria. You gotta do the most. Okay, period. <laughs> and now I'm using the Anastasia Beverly Hills. Um, I think that's the, I don't know, the iridescent, like, highlighter palette. I, I can't remember the name. That's the sugar palette. There we go. See, I'm forgetting. Um, I use the color Gumdrop. And you see how my eyes are iridescent. My cheeks got to be iridescent too, baby. Like, come on. Now, this is <laughs> just my gems. I'm so excited. Okay. I got those gems from Amazon. I believe they were like $8. I'm going to leave the link in the description. So you guys can definitely pick you up some gems. And there is a lot of gems that came with it, okay? Um, I definitely used the NYX glitter glue, and I'm just putting the um, the glue on my like you know eye area, so I can definitely have like a map out sense on where I want to put the gems. All right, y'all, y'all see me adding the gems using the white eyeliner pencil. Now, that is the trick. Y'all want to put the gems on y'all face, y'all have to use the white eyeliner pencil because the white eyeliner pencil is tacky um, and it's just going to stick. Now, my lip combo is the Charlotte Tilbury uh, lip pencil and the lipstick and pillow talk and the Maybelline um hyaluronic acid lip gloss i'm gonna just leave it in the description and then i'm just brightening my inner corner but that lip combo baby y'all see that and look at that eye makeup oh baby you can't touch this this period this is the look this is the vibes <laughs> okay all right I'm, I'm hyping myself up but it's beautiful guys All right, guys, this is the finished look on my Euphoria makeup. This is different, oh my gosh. I feel like I did a okay job. This is way, way, way 
different. I can't believe I did it. But anyway, I hope that you guys really, really enjoyed this makeup look. If you guys enjoyed this makeup look, definitely, definitely leave a like, you guys. Leave a like and comment down below on if you guys enjoyed my Euphoria makeup or if you guys want to see more of my Euphoria makeup ideas leave a comment down below and don't forget you guys don't forget to hit that subscribe button definitely definitely support your girl i'm definitely enjoying doing my makeup looks like i would step outside like this i don't care what people would think of me anyway thank you guys so much for watching I really, really appreciate the support. Come on, hit that subscribe button. Come on, I'm trying, to, I'm trying to achieve goals on this YouTube. And I wanna bring you guys along with me to Sean J out. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.